Hey guys and welcome back. Today what I'm going to be doing is uh, taking apart, let's see if I can zoom out, no I can't, um, a Sega Genesis cartridge using a, uh, a Pro Kit 31 video game screwdriver kit. So let's go ahead and do that. This is a uh, James Buster Douglas boxing. It has the security bits right here. Let's go ahead and open this up. Get the screwdriver itself. The adapter, if I can get it out. And the bigger security screw bit for Sega. Super in. The other side. We are at the uh, Sega Genesis PCB for the uh, boxing game here. What is it again? James Buster Douglas Boxing. And so here's the uh, EEPROM. It's a 40 pin. So what I'm going to be doing is hockoing that stuff. Hacko, Hacko FR300. Let's go ahead and do that, you guys. Let's see now if I uh, lift, if I can lift the the ROM here. No, I might have to do is uh. Plug in uh, my soldering iron. Uh, let's take a look at this. Uh, sometimes, if you shake the pins back and forth, they break their con uh, contacts. This um, the ROM. Nice. Come on, nice. Thanks for the Hako. Hako? Hako? And what I'm going to do now is um, go for the blue board. 
see this 40 pin uh, tin deal I'm gonna put that in its place here all right so you guys uh, what I end up doing is I didn't get it on video camera but I soldered this uh, tin IC socket to the PCB board of the Buster James Douglas boxing and yeah so and here's the uh, ROM so let's go ahead and install it Make sure no pins are popping out. And there we have it. So, what I basically did was, you know, desoldered the uh, the ROM, soldered on the IC socket, and what I'm going to be doing with this donor board is. Uh, when I get uh, some EEPROMs and an EEPROM uh, writer, I'm good to uh, copy some Sega Genesis games for the arcade machine out there. And yeah, so I could plug and play this, you know, or get a few more sports donor cards. They're real cheap. They're only like $2. Like, I ripped off the sticker, but it was like $1.99 or something for this, you know, game. So, so yeah, that's my plan. And I want to, um, get some EEPROMs, burn some uh, Sega Genesis ROMs on there and uh, test them out in the future. So yeah, you guys. Yeah, too bad I didn't show you the video of uh, me soldering this on, but whatever. It glitched out. Alright, you guys. Freaking awesome. Have a freaking good one.